All right, cool. So me and Masami, hey, we just got out of seeing a free early screening of Ghost in the Shell. Oh God, sorry. My, my cholesterol's God. higher now. <laughs> And, okay, so I'm gonna give my perspective on this, and I, I'm, oh man, all right. So I'm gonna say, okay, race aside, all that stuff. Visually, it was very like it was very well done. Visually, is very well done. The, the special effects, whether makeup or visual effects, you know, practical effects or whatever, that was done really well. You know, the the whole like you know cyberpunk kind of look of it. I love cyberpunk. It looked really cool. Costumes, amazing. Hair, amazing. All that shit, I love it. Right. Um. But I have to say, like, storyline, like, I kind of know, like, obviously the idea of it, but I feel like storyline, it was just kind of like, bam, you go into, oh no, we gotta put your brain in the, in the robot body, all right, your brain's in the robot body, okay, well, now you're part of this, like, tactical force of people, and then, cool, and then, oh, brain stuff happens, okay, things get confused, wait, I'm not who I, what? confused and then you know i found out that weird uh disfigured android body guy was, was my boyfriend was my boyfriend who boyfriend who, i think yeah yeah and i had a feeling that there, there was some history with those two you know when you like you, like in the trailer i was like ah, okay i knew there was some history which is why like he does the whole like you are not who the you think you are kind of shit in the trailer that you heard. It got like really weird. And they also and, made him white. Mm -hmm. Yeah, they did that too. So, okay. Sorry. I know it's not my turn, but yeah. I'm but, angry. But, yeah, but here's the other thing. Okay. Again, storyline. All that race stuff aside. That third act was really weak. Because it was just like, it was like, it wasn't like a big build up, it was like a build up like, oh, she's gonna find herself, she's gonna, you know, fight the machines as a machine, you know, that kind of stuff. But then it was just kind of like, I don't know what to do, I'm just gonna. <laughs> it was like, you know, limp wristed kind of fighting, kind of, not literal fighting. Actually, yeah, even then, there wasn't, actually, yeah, there wasn't any literal fight. And it was kind of, it was kind of weak ass. It was just kind of like, all right, I'm just gonna jibbity bob, like, do that shit. Like, all right. And then, there's that part in the third act where if it wasn't for the fact that the camera was moving, I would not have known that her character was running because I was like, oh, we're just seeing debris. Oh, I guess she's running away, uh, you know? But yeah, so to talk about the race. Now, I know I made the video about the fucking, you know, trailer and I kind of got off like really crazy and then fanboys fucking lost their shit on me. Now, okay. First, this is back in November, I was just like, well, why would ScarJo have to play an Asian? Why can't she be Asian? All right, fine, her character is white now. Okay, but like, add insult to injury. In the goddamn movie, you find out, yeah, she was originally Japanese. And then they put her, like- They put her brain, brain into, into a, a white, white body, body. Which they kept saying, oh, you're so beautiful. Yeah, like your white face, your westernized face is so beautiful. Not, oh, and also in the beginning when you see like the, like the brain stuff and you get, you see her get put into the body, that character, that first character, that first swipe of like color has monolids. But then all of a sudden like, uh, you know, fade to black, fade out. Oh, Scardra with your, you know, double eyelids and all that stuff. And I'm like, Ha. Huh. Okay. Sure. You know? Yeah. And then with the racing, yeah. So then the boyfriend guy, and then it's like, again, they're, they're using the original names because like on the, that's a garbage bag in the middle of the road. <laughs> yes, it is. <laughs> but yeah, so, you know, the original character's name is what? Mo Motoko? Mo 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 uh, no, mo Mokoto. Mokoto. Okay, Mokoto. Sorry. I was like, I, was like, I don't want to butcher it, you know? Yeah. Um, That was the name. But her, ScarJo's character, name is Mira because you can't make it too Japanese because her, she's white and then so but then the original girl the Japanese girl whose brain is inside that body's name is that and then the original Asian dude's name that's inside the the torn up Hideo. android yeah is Hideo so you got these very very Japanese names very very Japanese people and put into white bodies and like I, I we even joked around 
Well, like, so, like there was like a couple of dudes when we came out the bathroom. One dude was like, two out of ten. No, you know, like no Asian major. I'm not for this. You know, I gave him a high five. And I even said, like, I even made a joke saying, like, yeah, people are like, oh, well, you're Asian on the outside. Uh, Asian. You're Asian on the inside. You're white on the outside. Like, don't most Asian people wish they were white anyway? Which, fuck you on that. Like a reverse <laughs> banana. Yeah. And so, yeah, it's like that. And it's like, um, no. And then, shit, there was something else. Like, um, uh, but yeah, I also was trying to give the benefit of the doubt because, you know, I was like, okay, maybe it's just kind of like how Blade Runner is. It's just like a really big kind of Chinatown, but like Japan town, like something like that. Yeah, 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 let me benefit of the doubt. No, 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 they're in Japan. At one point you see in the skyline, there's like a Honda thing, like Honda dealership, Honda plant, Honda, Japan. We're in Japan, bro, serious. You know, it's like, I, I don't know. I'm like, I'm at a loss for words at it because it's like, fine. After the first trailer came out and, and I just said, fuck it. I got mad and I was like, fine, is what it is. Maybe it still looks good. It looks good, but then you add insult injury to be like, yeah, she, you know, he really, she really was Japanese, but made her white. And then the fact that she finds her own like mother Japanese. again, her own Japanese mother again, who was so inviting to a random stranger to the house, because we even said, we're like, what Asian person just goes, hey, person who just pet my, who just pet my cat? Come in and have tea. Oh yeah, I'm gonna tell you about my dead kid. All right, you know? That was, yeah. I, like I said, race aside, that third act was weak as hell. Visuals were good, but with the race stuff, no, go away, go away. Yeah. So, and then now you're prepared. <laughs> okay. Well, all of the race stuff was mentioned. Yeah. I'm really angry about it. Yes. I'm very angry about it. Yes. Actually, in the theater, you, she, I called it the the angry baby thing, where you like. Yeah, because I kept doing this. She kept holding the fist. Oh, yeah, no, because I've yeah. been upset about this for a while, taking a Japanese character and making it ScarJo. It's like, I didn't really give it the benefit of the doubt. I'm not that great at that. Um, <laughs> well, for but... once, I'm the bigger person. That's, that's a surprise. <laughs> anyway, <laughs> anyway, yeah. it just proves that I'm right more. <laughs> so, <laughs> so... I can't even get mad at that. I can't even get mad. Well, um... Okay, to actually give a critique, as somebody who grew up watching the film, and I, I'll be honest, like, I'm not as big as a fan as I should be. It took me a moment to remember, like, Mokoto's name, or is it Motoko? Like, it's honestly, no, it's Mokoto. That, like, little details like that, uh -huh. I don't have memorized. So I'm not as big as a fan as I should be. Right. That said, you know, I did watch the film as a kid um, with my dad, who is Japanese, who... Uh -huh was also very angry. He didn't see the film, but I doubt he will. Yeah, he wouldn't. He would not. Um, so what they tried to do to pay homage to the original Ghost in the Shell movie, not the, not the anime that came after, not the original manga, uh, they took a lot of the visuals from the original film, which the original film I love, beautifully done. They did a lot of that whole entire sequence where she's first in a robot body and then she's like coming out and floating up. It's like, yeah, ooh, yeah. now you have skin and you have everything that you need to be human. Yeah, like I, I, in my mind when I watched that scene, I called it the fifth element thing when they're yeah. putting, putting her back together. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's, it's that, they, that was like scene for scene. There was a few things where they did scene for scene. And if you see that and you're the, a fan of the original film, you'll be like, oh, good, they remember that. However, however. <laughs> With the storyline, what? <laughs> what? Yeah. I mean, the only thing that ScarJo did to really copy the original character uh -huh. from the film was act completely emotionless, even though she's burning on the inside. Or like um, that very robotic walk she had. Yes, that very robotic. Yeah. Walk. Well, even in the film, she didn't have the robotic walk. Oh, okay. Well, and yeah. She was like, and another. They change up the plot. Okay, they change up the plot. They change up the plot they, yeah. so that ScarJo is the first of Ever. her kind. The first okay. of her kind. Where so, in the original, in the original anime, okay. she was like Diamond Dozen. Like oh, that's okay. just what happened. Like, oh, okay. the, like her specific form was like a rather common form. Okay, okay. There was like times in the film where she was like looking at another android and the android turned and had the exact same face. Oh, okay, okay. that's just a very common thing. Okay, that was okay. just like, 
Okay. You want number 12 or number two? Like stuff like okay, that. Okay, I gotcha. Just... All right, cool, cool. So they just made her the special little special snowflake. Little I guess snowflake. I guess the we're... messiah of robotics. And right. You were the you were the best one, the chosen one, and you were the yeah, final form. It became a chosen one story. Oh god, which and... I hate. I always hate that shit. Oh, and then they like. Then they give her a boyfriend, and the thing with Bato is that he's also a robot. He's entirely sight. Like, oh, okay. He's entire. That's why he never has the eyes. It's that oh. he never had the eyes. Okay. And that's, well, like, see, uh, that's news to me. Spoiler: He does not originally have robot eyes in the film. Those kind of get blown up. <laughs> yeah. Spoiler. Yeah. <laughs> this is all spoilers. Um. Of course, yeah. yeah. So, so yeah, they have they they give they give homage to it in a lot of ways, but story wise, they change up the character. I. It also felt like torture porn. Like a lot of the time, she kept getting like shocked with like random, oh yeah, 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 yeah. like objects, and then like getting yeah, yeah, it was like like it was like it was like cattle prods. Yeah, things were very. It was very like phallic things being like 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 poked and prodded at a tiny woman kind of thing. Yeah, yeah. And she's Asian on the inside. She's Asian on the inside, so so on the inside, she's a little submissive. (laughs) Oh my god. (laughs) Yeah, I know, right? So it was just like. (laughs) Not only is everyone complimenting her, yeah. like for being so beautiful, so perfect uh, now, uh, but they're like hitting her with stuff. Yeah. And I feel like they also. This is this is my very this is very much my humanities training background and yeah. Anger coming out. <laughs> so, um, I also felt like. Not only was it like hitting her randomly with phallic objects and having her scream. Yeah. But it was also like. They kind of backed off on a lot of the, like I know in the trailers, sir, it hinted at her questionable sexuality. Oh but yeah, because you think she's gonna be all mad lesbian with that one yeah, chick. Yeah, you think freckles. she's going to be mad lesbian, but instead she's just like, mush mush. Your face mush, is mush, weird. Mush, mush mush mush. Your face. Who would be okay with that? Yeah. Who would also think that's hot? Did yeah. anyone look at that scene and think it's hot? <laughs> oh, you just touched my face. Cool, yeah, man. Yeah, just like she touches her eyelids. That's like oh, not at one point her out. her finger goes like right here. She's like, oh, I'm like, Aah. I was yeah. like really uncomfortable. Was like, Does anyone find that sexy? Is this the sexy scene? <laughs> <laughs> That's I true. Mean, in the trailer, they have it so that they like smooch or something. Even where where it's like, like it's, it's like really over. close. Like like we're about to kiss, but we're right there, but it's we're like not. Yeah. Really dry. It's no. Oh, okay, you're gonna try to make this somewhat sexy. Yeah. Um, but they cut that out. And then they have like, did, did you remember that moment where they had like the trans character, but it was like oh, in yeah, the yeah, bathroom? Yeah, yeah, because like it was a, a lady robot, but she was peeing standing up. Yeah, yeah. So it's just like. And the partner was like, oh, that was kind of strange, but it's yeah, like. Yeah, but it's just like, why would you? It, it sort of, but it sort of seemed. Like they shoehorned in. Yeah, shoehorned in, and she's like, I don't know about you, but it also seemed like this character is a, a joke. So we're just doing a gender weird. Oh my god, everyone's robot. So you can even have trans people. Right, but trans robots, but it's like, what, but why does that have to why be a thing? That, why, why are you making that into something that's really weird? Yeah. Why can't you just, if it's like, okay, everything's is what fluid, it is. Yeah. then you could just say, all right, just just have a character that's not defecating or yeah. pissing in front of you and just. Yeah. I mean, that was anyway. weird. That was weird. Yeah. That was weird. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> okay. Um. But how'd you feel about that weak ass third act? The the weak ass third act. It was really bizarre. Uh huh. To have it be like, oh no, we both came from this weird. We were both living in this weird little building little that, for hut. some reason, was never destroyed. Right. Even though it was set on fire. fire. Yeah. Set on fire. Fire. Um, and then it's like, oh, it turns out. We were a boyfriend, girlfriend. Yeah, so it's we like, carved her names in like the wall. We carved her names in the wall. Also, why did she run away? What? Was right. she actually? It a- seemed like her mom was a really nice lady. Her like, was like, and then she died. I'm sad. Uh, they I gave me ashes. Yeah, <laughs> they gave me her ashes anyway. Do you like tea? Tea? All right. Do you tea. like tea? Yeah. Um, she, I mean, she'd invite a stranger into her home, so I guess she'd be nice to her daughter. But I don't know. Maybe. Right. But it's just. And, and it didn't really make sense. Like, uh-huh. what exactly, like, what exactly was, like, the, it, it seems like they were trying to have an Avengers moment where it's like, everybody, team up. And oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. People. Yeah, suit up, mount up. Boop. And so they have Araki and Togusa and Bato, like, shooting people, and Bato has his cute little beagle, another another hint at the film. There's a lot of beagles in the original. Oh, the okay. guy has a thing with beagles. Okay, but they're yeah. adorable, so they're why not? They're adorable, so why not? Yeah. Um, 
But it's just like bang, bang, bang. We're done. Yeah, Same like I said, it, I, I, like I said, it felt like it wasn't that much of a battle. Just like bang, bang. Oh, yeah. okay. I'm expecting some suspense. I'm uh, expecting, you know, like just be like, oh, oh, oh. But it was more like, oh, oh okay. Yeah. Right. And I mean, they were trying. They were totally trying to go with like a third film, suggesting that he was now somehow inside of her ghost, which is what actually does happen in the original animation. Okay. But. They, it's way more dramatic, and she's actually the one who has her head crushed. Oh, okay. So they, yeah, they change around things uh -huh. with with the characters. Which, okay, fine. You're gonna you insist on having this guy be a physical dude instead of like in the original animation, he's like half a lady. Okay. He's actually a, like a female torso. So ah. it's not even a he. It's just like I'm this I'm this AI that just kind of formed on the internet. Ah, okay. I take over bodies. Uh, I don't really care what body. God, so it's like they put like a, a like a love interest there. Just again, like they just uh, let's throw also a love interest in there. God, yeah. that's oh let's man. Let's throw in a blonde love interest, even though everyone here should have been Asian. <laughs> and then you have like even the gar guy in the garbage truck be Asian, and he got more lines than a lot of the main characters. Oh my god. Why, the, why, yeah. why does Lee Cunningham get to have more lines than? Araki, and then you have his lines cut off because for some reason the film forgot that subtitles were a thing. Oh my god, yeah, yeah, yeah. That was another thing. Like, sometimes like the subtitles would be like far below the oh, screen. Araki only spoke in Japanese. He only so spoke. You know. Yeah, he only spoke in Japanese just to really drive it home just how super Asian he was. But just him, just him. No one else. Everyone else spoke English, so they weren't that Asian. Yeah. Um, but yeah, sometimes like the subtitles wouldn't, would be like down here. Sometimes it'd be right there. Sometimes it'd be like right next to you, like here. But there were times where like, he'll say something. And I'm like, well, I have no idea what you're saying, bruh. Like, I'm a different kind of Asian. <laughs> and he, well, I mean, I'm not that great of it, but he was also speaking, I'm not that great at Japanese, and he was speaking like old man, somewhat polite, but really not Japanese. Yeah, because you, because most of it, even if I understood Japanese, there was a lot of, I'm old man sounding, so it was just hard to hear anyway. Yeah, well, yeah. and then he shot people with a revolver, like a, yeah. No, it was a cult, like he shot, it's always not even a cult, it was like, Almost a flintlock. Yeah, it was like which a, is, which it's a is very cool. old gun. It, th that's the thing with a lot of these kind of like futuristic kind of stories though that they like to do is also always bring a really old gun in because it's an old guy, he's stuck in his way so he's gonna have an old gun. Like it's always like that kind of stuff. Like a lot of these stories they like to throw that in too. That's, which that's which always <laughs> like just on a random note, not even a gun, but like like freaking Will Smith at iRobot was like, oh, these converses. Oh, yeah. No, that's true. <laughs> you know what? That was something that it, well, didn't even hint at that much. I'm not quite sure what the moral of this film was. I guess it was technology can destroy you. Right. But yeah, I felt like there wasn't, like, again, it was pretty and it, it looked cool and all that stuff, but I felt like there wasn't much to it, you know? Yeah, no. Oh, God. Okay, this one will drop or Wait, something? is it? Maybe, maybe what it's secretly doing, maybe it's secretly very progressive, saying how technology will convert all of us into the same culture, i.e. whiteness. Oof. Maybe it's actually really smart and I just can't get it. Uh, I don't think I want to get that. No. You notice how all the, like, pretty much everyone who was darker than khaki in that film uh -huh. was, like, pretty much not, like, not that enhanced visually. Yes. Yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. Even the guy in the beginning who was the yeah. president of some... Head of African nation or something. Yeah, like, that's... the African nation. Yes. The one African nation. The nation of Africa. The as nation they of like Africa. To say. Yeah. Um. Even he was like, you know, that. You know, yeah. I like cyber th things and inserts and all that, but it's like it gets a little weird. And then everyone around him dies. Yeah. And it's like, oh. Yeah. Yeah. No. No. Everyone brown was just like, I yeah. Don't feel like it. And then right. they all died and turned white. Yeah. 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 Oh my God. Yeah, and because this was like, since, since this was, like I said, a free screening, um, so we waited in line for like a while, and then, uh, you know, pretty much when we got in, there were certain seats marked for, I guess, us, like, people who got our tickets a specific way, which, again, is fine, but as I was about to be like, oh, hey, dude, there's two seats right next to each other that we could sit at, the house lights went completely dark. That and did I, not help. And it was just like, geez, of course, like, 
people who just got in there were like, all right, let me start like taking my phone out with a flashlight. And all these fucking people were like freaking out like, ah, it's shining on my face. It's like, you looked at it. I shined it on a seat. Why are you looking at it, you know? And then some other like, cause I was like a hop over the seat to get to my seat and my shoes untied, but I'll deal with that later. Um, Fucking, the lady got so mad thinking I was gonna spill her freaking like five dollar drink or something. And it's like, and it's like, ma'am, you probably shouldn't be drinking that soda anyway. It's not good for you, you know. It's also like we didn't touch your drink. Yeah. Chill. I literally like it, it was because I was holding my jacket and it hovered over her fucking her fucking coke, and she's like, watch my drink, and I was like, bitch. Granted, she probably paid five dollars for a coke, but yeah. But bitch, who told you to do that? Like, yeah, I, mind you, just not going in. Yeah, mind you, like I pay for shit at the theater anyway. But I got that all that reward shit, so I get it for like half off all the time. Oh my god, kids, move, bitch, get out the way. Okay. That was. That yeah. Was, but yeah. I'm very angry after that film. So pretty much like. Pretty much final thoughts is visually it's cool. Uh, yeah. Visually it's great. Uh, yeah. We saw because the special screening was actually an IMAX 3D. Um well it wasn't real IMAX, the one I'm used to where the screen is like big as my dick kind of big. So but the 3D was alright because they did have stuff fly at you, you know? Yes, but it's like it wasn't but it, it seemed like it was built. It was more atmospheric than yeah. anything, yeah. yeah. So visually it's cool. Storyline weak. Very weak. And then just the, the whole, you know, the you know, yeah, I know. Yeah, no. But yeah. Yeah, no. I would say, in all honesty, if you're curious, it's a rental, like Netflix. I wouldn't suggest, like, go out there. Because, in all honesty, if this wasn't free, we wouldn't be here right now. No. We wouldn't be here right now. No, my father is already, probably already having a heart attack. Yeah. And my grandfather died again. Yeah. Yeah. And then my dad is screaming at me from the grave. And just, not because of the movie, just because he just does that. Uh, <laughs> but yeah, so. How he says, I love you? Well, yeah. That, 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 that's, real, that's how he is. That's how he is. Um, but anyway, yeah. So, Ghost in the Shell. Too many white people. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. <laughs>